My name is Steven Hamill. My age is 16 and my fight camp is Crusaders MMA. My nickname is the Carolina Kid. I'm called the Carolina Kid because I'm from North Carolina and I look like Uriah Faber, so Carolina Kid. MMA has changed my life by, uh, it's put me around a lot of good people, put me in a good environment, made me better myself as an individual. My favorite part of training is running. I don't know, it's easy to me. Catch a pace, go forever. I wanna say to my opponent, better be ready. I'm gonna take him into the deep rounds and let's hope he can make it. Matthew Hefner, I'm 16 years old and I'm training out of Atlas MMA in Crestview, Florida. I started doing Jiu Jitsu um, around nine years old and I started doing Muay Thai, which is what I'm competing in today, around 11 years old. My parents are together and uh, lived in a small house in a small town, um, a bunch of chickens, pigs, goats, all kind of stuff like that. Um, usually drive to the nearest town about 30 minutes away but uh, to go train I drive about an hour and a half every other day to go train. Good luck on your fight thanks for coming out you know we both kind of driven uh, about six hours I, I want to say to come here so uh, good luck. First please welcome to the cage Stephen Hamill. Steven Hamill making his way to the cage, representing Crusaders MMA, currently 1 and 0 in no kickboxing competition. Uh, kickboxing is always fun. Yeah, and this is a youth competitor. This is uh, the fir our first uh, three bouts are going to be youth kickboxing, which is so much fun to watch. Real quick before we get started, though, uh, a big uh, shout out to Sweet Melissa's Billiards, Tennessee Brown Bag, many. Uh, Minnie Mouse, the Ice Cream Dream, Kai Bistro, John Water, The Farm, Tennessee LLC, Bell Heating and Air, Clark Salon and Spa, Chattanooga Mixed Martial Arts Cottage, Float Therapy, Peyton Carly Lenz, and Great Scott Graphics. And we are so excited to be here at the Saudi Daisy Wrestling Arena. And there you see him making his way to the cage, Matt Hefner. One and one in amateur striking, uh, competing tonight in Muay Thai, competing out of Assassin's MMA. And man, you, you look at that kid, I mean, he literally looks like a kid. I think we're gonna, it's gonna be different once they get inside the cage though. It's gonna be wild, man. I'm really looking forward to watching. I love watching the youth kickbox. They're always fired up, man. They're always ready to go. Chandler. Man, you're working with a few youth competitors, not only in wrestling, but uh, you've got a youth kickboxer getting ready to compete. Talk about the, the youth in combat sports. Yeah, absolutely. You know, every kid feels like they have something to prove. So whether it's in a gym or in competition, you know, they're, they have like that, uh, that pre-adult ego in a way. So they always have to try to like come out and do their best and like basically like be the center of attention. So right now, uh, I'm excited just about uh, what's, what we're about to see, man. Uh, this kid in the, in the cage, though, I like the way he said that he was the Carolina kid. Um, the Uriah Faber little comment that cracked me up. Yeah, the but California this, kid. But this kid, he seems super nice, super calm. Well, there he is, Matt Hafner making his way into the cage. Let's send it back to Jennifer for our official introductions. This bout is scheduled for three two-minute rounds. First, fighting out of the blue corner, he weighed in at 135 pounds holds an undefeated record of one win with zero losses, and represents Crusaders MMA, Stephen Hamill. And his opponent across the cage to my left in the red corner, he weighed in at 136 pounds, holds a record of one win with one loss, and represents Assassin's MMA, Matt Hefner. Chandler Goins. Someone's always got to go. Gonna get loud. Oh, in no, here, take boys. it back. He's one and one. Someone has to lose anyway. It's about to get loud in here. I guess it. Here we go. Let's here we go. go. A touch of gloves. Oh. Right off the rip. Oh, Ooh, good kicks. Hamill moving forward. Oh, Matt Hefner beating him in the middle, though. Clean, clean striking Ooh. from Green. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, hey. Ooh, good right hand. Nasty, nasty. You Mouth see, he's falling out. Oh, but he's jawing a little bit. Yeah, Man, but big, he's jawing. Hook, big hook from Matt Hefner. 
You see Ham oh, Hamel there man. in the black and red. Matt Hefner in the green. Missed on the knee. Oh, it's nasty. Ooh. Good work from... He's touching him up, boss. Oy. Good leg kick right there. Really good pace nasty. from both of them right now. Oh, good head little kick. head kick. Good slip. Clean. They both look nasty, man. So young, so nasty. That's insane. Good body shot. Nice See, another yeah, one. You notice Hefner switching stances, landing from the southpaw, and then switching back to orthodox. Uh, and then boy. the clinch work. Can the youth knee to the head? No. Okay. <laughs> Absolutely well, they, not. They, they are just missing. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> they ain't thinking about that. No, but it's no, something I, you got to watch out for, though, because if you do lean into it, uh, it's no harm, no foul. No, that's your fault. Okay. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. Straight down the pipe. Oh, oh, straight shots. He's, uh, he's eating him up. He but he's still jawing. back in his mouth. Yeah, he needs to. Stephen Hamill taking those shots well, but they are youth competitors. The Clean. referee's not going to let oh, you take too many. Up. He's lining him up. Eating him up, nothing too hard, nothing too hard. He's touching him, touch, touch, touch them big ones. He ain't just winging them. Oh, there goes the mouthpiece. Do not dip that head. What if he, yeah, I thought he was going to Hefner that head. has really put on right now. He is, uh, yeah, his pace has out. been unreal. He's showing out. Oof. And putting Oof. together all the components. See, touch, 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 big ones. For sure. And you see both of these competitors still fresh as rain right there now. We go. No, uh, no fatigue, no signs of fatigue at all. It's just clean striking, man. Ooh, good slip right there. For Oof. Good little left hook, body keep. I think Hefner's uh, looking a little fresher than the two, but they're both slinging. Oh, oh. good left hand oh. right there. Good left hand. Oh, oh. Hand oh. Kick. Oh. down. Oh. Go, Stephen Hamill. Kick. Good left kick to the head. Big head kick. He's got the tie. He got what a standing ten count, right? Okay. Here we go. I think it caught him off guard, man. And that's a, a lot of time in five oh, nights. Hey, head kick back. That's what drops you is the ones you don't see coming. I mean, <laughs> surprising when they good. Oh, oh, beautiful knee to the body. Knee, yeah, nasty knee to the belly. Hefner's clean, man. Hefner's clean, and he's calm. Hamill starting to get a few of his strikes through, though. Oh. More than in round one. He is definitely trying to make it a dirty fight, but he's got to watch out for those knees on the inside. That's why I, I feel like that's his key to victory. He has to make this a lot. Jab's you know, nasty from Hefner. That knee's nastier. nasty. That knee's nasty. He's hurting from that knee. Oh, yeah. Oh, but another, another big, big head, kick. head kick from Matt Hefner. If I'm oh. Him, oh, you can't dip into that. If I'm him, I'm trying to make this as nasty as possible in the pocket. Cause, uh, good God. Hefner's Hef clean, man. Yeah, Hefner has some really good technique right now. Uh, With that being said, though, I mean, Hamill is tough as nails. Yes. Them body shots he's taken. I mean, you can see it on his body. It's, uh, he's, it's oh, red. big right straight. hand. Down the pop. Oh, good slip and roll. Oh, oh another big head kick. kick. Hit, him in the, hit him in the chin. Oh. Hefner starting to possibly pull away yeah. here. You're starting to see the fatigue in Stephen Hamill. Hefner's round on that one for sure. The last, first we go, boys. Oh, here we go. Oh, no touch. He said forget Hamill that. not holding back here. He knows he needs to win oh. this thing. He's getting touched a lot. Nice if, check there. If you're Hamill, you got to turn it into a dogfight, you know? Especially now with open scoring. That, that I really enjoy that. Because you know what you got to do. He's a little tired, man. And he's getting touched so much when he tries. Oh, oh man. He Just, barely dipped away, but again, so dangerous to do that. Barely missed that head kick. Oof. You know, he keeps slipping off. He's going to get the Leon Edwards special. Oh, God, yeah. That was wild. But props for Stephen Hamill for moving forward, trying to take this thing. There's no fear in his eyes. A bit of oh, frustration because he knows straight. he's behind. But 100% coming to fight. You know, with so much action, we forget these are the youth, man. This kids. is these are kids, but I mean, God Almighty, what a good display! Oh, oh. now that oh. It, 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 you know, it could, yeah, it could be that uh, he ducked into it. Yeah. I don't know that he was attempting to throw a knee to the head. I'm not 100 percent sure he had the head, did it? I, I think chest. they're stopping it just to just to, to check. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I got you. 
unintentional. One of the best refs in the game, fight. Chandler. Yeah, I'm pretty good at what I do. I st <laughs> 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 the best armchair ref in the business right here. Right here. Oh, oh. I keep I see a head kick coming is the thing. I'm oh. not good at introductions to fights, oh. but I'll <laughs> play by play we'll call it. Good slip, good slip. Hefner Ooh. continuing to dazzle the crowd here. 16 years old. Uh, oh. It's just insane. He keeps ducking that head and it's worrying me. I mean, right here, I mean, Hamill has to go for broke. Oh. But I think he's just exhausted, I mean, yeah. at this point. At the end of these three rounds, we go to your judges' scorecard for decision. All three judges score this fight in favor of your winner by unanimous decision. Out of the red corner, Matt Hefner. So good, I feel a little tired, but you know, overall it's a good fight. Um, thanks to my opponent for coming out, driving so far, putting up a good fight. We knew the first round would be a little harder, and then hopefully we gas out. Um, you know, obviously I was looking for a knockout, but that didn't happen. I got knocked down, which is good enough for me. I ain't got nobody to call out, you know. Not too many kids want to come fight, but hey, if you're a kid out there below 18, uh, and you want to come fight, I'm 135. If you're 140 and below, let's go.